the beginning of a new era. When I said that I had a reason for being patient, it was because I know that we are all from one family. And if we have a disagreement, no matter how bad it is, it should be resolved. But it, is, it, it has become very clear that this disagreement there is no headway to it. And for a lot of reasons, there are very, very visible evidence that there is sabotage, deliberate attempt to sabotage this administration. For that reason, we have to move forward. Yes. And moving forward, if it means taking decisions that is going to hurt anybody, to hell with that person. Maybe where they are, they are telling them nothing will happen, nothing will happen. It's happening here, life. <laughs> <laughs> we have our own legislatures that are performing their duty according to the Constitution. So that record is threatened. There is no two ways about it. For those of you who like grammar, no ambiguity in that one. <laughs> Coming to our brand new commissioner, you've already been sworn in, so I can't call the designate again. Everybody knows your area of specialization. I'm happy that you're already a son before coming in. It means that you must have been a thorough man. It's not the one that while you're here, they now pay money to give you son. <laughs> when you become the son, the only thing you do is to sabotage government. Instead of you to close your mouth, you go publicly to claim that you're a learned person. To go publicly to tell people that you are the, 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 the chief law officer. Chief law officer, you were here, you went to stand before a magistrate court. At that time, you didn't remember that you were chief law officer going against the ethics of your job. Shame to you, wherever yes. you are. Shame. Like I said, you will get your reward, not in this world, though, yeah, this, this world. world. Yeah. So, my brother, Dagogo Eboroma, you're going to be the brand new Attorney General of our dear state. <laughs> it's not an issue of going to the SSG, you already know you give him his letter, it's the Attorney General. Yes, and why are we bringing you at this very critical time? We have a lot of issues around us. We believe that you're not going to be the one that will, when they send uh, 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 service, uh, 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 service to you, you go and file nolly, or you go and file one thing that will kill us here. Please, defend us. <laughs> defend us, defend us. We know that you're going to defend us because your record is, is, is clean. Eh? You're a gentleman, peaceful. You're not a noisemaker. People like that are endowed, and they have a fear of God. Yes. Let, me, let me also say this. You have a big tax. As it is today, in the local palace, they said the jungle has matured. We will be setting a panel of inquiry to investigate the affair of Governance. God bless you. God bless you. God bless you. So, God bless you. So, praise up. Praise up. Not in, I'm not going back on it. Any man who cocks a gun shoots it. And maybe because of the gun is in safety, the bullet didn't come out. 
has already killed, killed you. you. That's true. So if you have a way to bury that person kill them. or the group of person, we will bury them. Yes. So let me let me thank every one of you that has given us this support. God is with us. Yes. Amen. Don't allow anybody to deceive you. I had one one drug addict telling people that uh, I would have been in level 14 or level 15. You know, when you don't know people, you talk carelessly. And when you're already high, what do you expect? <laughs> <laughs> if in 2010 I was a chief accountant at level 13, those of you who know the civil service, where will I be before 2023? So when you see people, because, because you want to impress your paymaster, you talk carelessly. But I won't reduce myself to that kind of talk. No. I am the only governor in this state that, in the whole federation, where drug addicts as local government chairman will come and abuse, I take it. Oh. I'm the only person that, I mean, people that can't even talk to me, that are, they call them honorable members. I don't know what makes them honorable. For you to be honorable, there are a lot of qualities that people will see. Uh, being honorable is not lying. Being honorable is not, is not, there is not for, if, as a matter of fact, for, for one to be called honorable, you need to live a honorable life. Mm. But I, I wish them well. I wish that well because even if it's a mistake, by the special grace of God, I'm here today. Yes. Yes. So God, God doesn't make mistakes. Oh. And let me also appeal to them. Let them continue to make mistakes. <laughs> so that I'll continue to be where I am. Finish what I want to do for you people. Yes. Live with a good name. Yes. And my children and my great grandchildren yes. will be proud mm -hmm. of me. Amen. That is the mistake I want them to be making. Let me, on this note, thank every one of you, more especially the new, our new uh, attorney general. Please take full charge of that office. We have a lot of litigations there, both political and also economical. Economical because we have a lot of court cases on oil well and all those things. And there is one major issue we're having there. Since I came in, the number of garnishes, mm. I feel is a deliberate stint. Please, see what you can do to help us in this particular area. Thank you, and may God bless everyone.